Hi there. Good morning. Today I'm going to just show you my morning routine of um, getting ready in the morning, just putting on my face products. So I've washed my face. I have a clear skin. So I'm just going to get my hair off my face and I don't have right now a uh, hair bed. So I'm just going to use that. So first I use my Jack Black. I know it's a, like, it's a thin... Um, I love the smell, um, daily moisturizer, and it has SPF, so it keeps your skin protected. So I just put a little bit of that over. It's nice and light. It's not oily. So it's a great uh, base moisturizer. Then I'm going to put on a base to even out my skin tone. So I'll either use my YSL, um, it's really good and it has also SPF 22, or I'll use my Trish McVoy SPF 35, the Beauty Bomb, and it's tinted so it's good as well. Um, I guess today I'll use the Trish, I'll just do like, it goes a long way and it's thin so you don't feel like you've got most of using my mirror hair, just kind of evens out your skin tone. Mm -hmm. I like to put a little bit under my eyes and on the sides. So. Under my eyes. Go I'll cut off there, but just putting some coverage under the eyes. And then I like the SPF on my nose as well. That is that. Then I'll just prep my eyelashes. My curler here, it's just a Beauty 360 I just got at the store. Give my eyelashes a little lift. Then I'll be using my L'Oreal um, Voluminous Primer first, and then my Voluminous Black Mascara. I'll just lightly put on the primer. Got like a white color to it. all your lashes are gonna be nice length I like to get all the way to the ends and I also do the bottom because I like long lashes all all around base. Then I'll put on the black voluminous by L'Oreal. I've used this mascara for years. I just love it. It's inexpensive. It gives you great coverage. And it does actually great length and volume. And it also comes in waterproof if you need to use it at the pool. So it's great. See? Then I'm gonna do my brows. And first I'll outline them with my waterproof Sephora Dark Charcoal. It's cute, it's got the pencil on one side and then like a brush if you want to brush it out. And then on top of that I'll use my Urban Decay Brow Blade. It has a pen on one side and the pencil on the other side. It's got like an ink on the other side. So I just like this and color. taupe Trap by Urban Decay. So first I'll start outlining with my dark charcoal. Because I have actually 
start by brows. And you go just outline the line of your hairline. See, it's a good brow. Now do the other side. There, then with my Urban Decay, with the ink side, I'm going to just, usually I would use the pencil, but I'm all out of the pencil and Sephora is shipping it to me. So fill it in with the ink, the taupe. It just blends nicely and it gives it like a nice natural look. Add that kind of combination tone in your hair. It's a good brow. Then I'll get out my Sephora brushes, my little Sephora brush set, and my Charlotte Tilbury. It's um, it's really great set she has out, and I'm going to just take the primer color, the light, and just put it along my brow to make them pop and then just put it kind of all over the base kind of open everything up and I'll use my smaller brush for just a little bit to do a lot. And my last step is with my Too Faced blush. I'll just do some blush to put some color in the cheeks. So this is my Too Faced Perfect blush, Flush blush. It's a little heart's cute. And I'll just go from the cheekbone down. There we have it. And if I need to, I'll just blend a little on the side. And one last step I forgot is my, I do my Jurlique, um Calming Mist, and I love it. It just sets all the makeup, and it also helps your skin. So I just, on top of everything, just do one little spray. And it gives you a dewy look for the day. And there. Now we're ready for the day.